The excitement continues, and if all goes to plan, they'll reserve a place in the round of 16 here at the 2024 Euros. Is it on the cards? Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And an important date for them today because progression to the round of 16 here at the Euros is on offer. It's Croatia against Italy. Yeah, thanks, Derek. What a game this should be. Final match of the group stages, and only a win will see them through. Can they do it? Possibly, but I think it's going to be tight, nervy and very dramatic. I'm looking forward to this one. And the starting 11 for Croatia. Mateo Kovacic plays with Luka Modric in central midfield. And up front, it's the Croatian international, Andrej Kramaric. The cross is on. I'm not testing the keeper at all with that effort. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play. A goal! Accurate from the spot. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Ivan Perisic. Gvardiol. Well, it's one pass after another. Fratesi. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Crossing possibilities. Well, it did look promising, but no threat in the end. Kramaric. Can he put it in? Somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And in by Luka Modric. Still not clear. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. A room to roam on the wing. Very effective pass. And will it be the leveller? And fine goalkeeping. A corner from Modric. Oh, that's not a good clearance. Look at Modric. He read the situation defensively and did his job. They are a goal down, but perhaps a chance to create something from this corner. Not all that convincing defensively. Brozovic. Now with Perisic. It has to be. Off the post and back in play. Well, it was certainly a chance to get back into the game. And you have to say they're a bit unfortunate. But they do need to finish off one of these chances. Jorginho. Useful looking position, you've got to say. But they dealt with the threat posed. Barella. Di Marco. Back with Chiesa. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And a free kick awarded by the referee. And fired from the flank into the area. And the danger still on. Nicely timed tackle.
Kovacic. Davide Fratesi. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. And players waiting in the centre. It is now with Jorginho. It's still alive. Pulls it back. No way through. Oh, it's a penalty. Just what they wanted to avoid, given the scoreline. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty, yes. Yellow card, no. And the penalty is converted. I don't think anyone really questioned him. Well, here it is again. Great composure to send the keeper the wrong way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent penalty. And the whistle is sounded for... Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Federico Di Marco. Giorgio Scalvini. Really good, strong tackle, and it'll be a throw in. Jorginho. Really good challenge. Mateo Kovacic. And he might be through here. A goal! That's exactly what they needed. That should get them believing again. Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. Well, two one it is here. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. On the ball, Zaniolo. No well, foul play, says the referee. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. But it didn't end up being a significant advantage. And so a free kick here. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Mateo Kovacic, a really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Modric. It's looking promising. Could be. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. And a wild, wild attempt from distance. Not one for the highlight reel, Stuart. Well, that's a waste. He had much better options there. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And a lot to like about this attack. Perisic, surely the equaliser. And that's a very good parry. Calvini, Federico Di Marco. Well, not long to go. They're still trailing, and their hopes of moving on look rather bleak. Well, it doesn't look good, does it? They've found this group really tough at times, and today's been no different. As it stands, they won't be going through to the knockout stages. Brozovic. The ball with Luka Modric. And Italy with the ball again. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Substitution time it is here.
keeper did his job to begin with well no way through in the end Kramaric must score well his accuracy deserted him at a crucial moment well he had to score there that's probably the game over now Jorginho well he successfully got past him another great challenge free kick here and they just let his opponent glide by brilliantly blocked it's remaining and one thing is certain no one is leaving because it's still close this could be troublesome. And give the goalkeeper credit. How important was that? Well, what drama late on. It's a big chance, but I have to say, that's a magnificent save. Modric. Here's Kovacic. Nicolo Zaniolo. Well, a good tackle. There will be three minutes added on at the end. Barella. Chiesa. Well, just the tackle that was needed. And there it is, the final whistle. Three more points dropped. And that, unfortunately, Stewart will...